the Mongolian Titan. They are colossal. That's my best David Attenborough impression from this past summer's prehistoric planet. And if you had a chance to see it, you might have noticed a brief appearance at a waterhole in the Gobi Desert. Now, this animal's unknown, but it is believed to have come from a massive sauropod known as the Mongolian Titan, which was found in Mongolia in the Nemet Formation. And as stated, there's really only a footprint. That's really all we know about it as of this moment. It was part of a joint Mongolian-Japanese expedition, and they found the giant print, which measured a colossal 42 inches in length and was one of the biggest dinosaur footprints ever recovered. Now, it was discovered in the vast Mongolian desert and was found in a layer of rocks between 70 million to 90 million years in age. Now, that's a little bit of a gap, which makes pinpointing other animals that it might have lived with difficult, so we'll have to stay tuned to see what more comes of this, but it's really fascinating nonetheless. Now, the footprint itself was naturally cast as sand flowed into the dents that had been left by the creature as it stomped onto a once muddy ground. Again, pretty fascinating to think about this giant Mongolian titan stepping down into the mud and leaving an imprint for us to find all these years later. Now, the Mongolian titan and this footprint is believed to have belonged to a titanosaur, which was a group of giant long-necked dinosaurs. And based on the estimates of this footprint, scientists estimate that the creature might have, might have been 30 meters long and 20 meters tall. Again, this is enormous and it was briefly mentioned in Prehistoric Planet. Probably most people missed it, but the Mongolian Titan nonetheless. And I'm actually currently working on a full-length article for an upcoming issue of Prehistoric Magazine. If you'd like to subscribe, it's definitely free in the comments section below. Love to have you there. And let us know about the Mongolian Titan. Had you heard of it before? And if so, do you know anything about it? Take care.